Doe, rack them up. A quote supposedly from a fictional comedy character is being taken very seriously today. People are calling for Stephen Colbert's show to be canceled after a tweet about Asians appeared on the Comedy Central Twitter account. This is what went out, reading now, quote, I'm willing to show Asian community I care by introducing the Ching Chong Ding Dong Foundation for sensitivity to Orientals or whatever. Now the tweet apparently was a parody of the Washington Redskins owner outreach to Native Americans. There's controversy about the Redskins name in Washington. But a lot of people thought it went too far. Colbert has apologized, saying he did not write it, and says he doesn't know who did write it. Well, Joe Conch is a political and entertainment columnist for Mediate.com. And Joe, nice to see you, and good see morning you, to you. Okay, now, Colbert may not be responsible for this. What's the truth, we believe? What we believe is that a tweet went out from at the Colbert Report, has over one million followers, but that is not Stephen Colbert. However, the tweet is based on a character that he's played on the show for the last nine years, the, the ching chong ding dong that you... That's a long time. Uh, yes. Nine years. Mm -hmm. One it character is. lives. And, and the problem is that whenever somebody like Colbert or Stewart is called out for saying or doing something offensive, right? even if he didn't do this tweet, he has been doing that character for the last nine years, they hide behind the premise that this is satire. It's a joke, guys. Lighten up. Bill, and, and that, that only happens until they ask to be taken seriously, like John Stewart did on Crossfire, you know, I, lecturing I, I us I think you make that point maybe about Stewart more than Colbert, only because I see Stewart associate himself with more social issues than Colbert does. However, Colbert employs... 17 writers. 17. Correct. And all of them, Bill, are white. Most of them are male. So I find it ironic that this whole premise, as you mentioned before, goes on the, the Redskins name and, and Dan Schneider, the owner of the Redskins, should change it because it's racist. Yet Stephen Colbert doesn't practice what he preaches if we're looking at his hiring practices. 17 writers, all white, but there is no Asians out there. There are no Asians out there. There are no blacks that you could hire. Yet Dan Schneider's the racist. I find that very interesting. Oh, interesting. Bill. Okay. All right. Colbert sent out this tweet apparently from his. Twitter account. He said, hashtag cancel Colbert. I agree. Just saw a Colbert report tweet. I share your rage. Who is that, though? I'm Stephen at home. That would suggest he did not. Do did not endorse it. So that, no, the show is not being canceled. No, he's not going to be suspended or fired, nor should he. If you watch South Park for about five minutes, you'll see that the bar has been lowered very, very low on Comedy Central. I love South Park, don't get me wrong. But the only thing that I would say is change the Colbert Report to the Caucasian Report based on the culture <laughs> that is over on that well, show. Uh, that, I think you raise a good point. Sometimes these firestorms, they brew and they brew and you can't fight back against them or even stop them. Does this blow over? Or does it continue? It will blow over, most likely. It'll live maybe for about 24 hours. But again, Colbert has lasted for a long time. Stewart has. South Park's been on forever. Trust me, the Comedy Central can say and do whatever they want because it's all in the name of satire. Bill, well, it shouldn't be we'll taken seriously. We'll watch the Twitter feed and see what comes next. Absolutely. Thank you, Joe. Thank Joe Concha here from Mediate.com. All right. Martha, what's next?